What is up everybody and welcome back to another Among Us video and in this video I'll be telling you about a mysterious player that I'm sure if you've seen before. His name is Fortigreen, but you may know him as a crewmate who has a 3 question marks as a username. Recently this player has been joining several lobbies across all of Among Us and if you see him in your game you must be very careful or else something very bad will happen to you. I actually managed to encounter this mysterious player and you won't believe what he did to me so you won't want to miss this. And before we we get any further into this video I do want to mention that 70% of you have not hit that subscribe button which means that you're one of many who are missing out on Among Us Darkest Secrets so why not solve that issue by hitting the subscribe button with the bell icon turned on and if you do enjoy this video and want to see more make sure to leave a like down below but now let's begin with the story of Fortigreen there was once a mysterious player known as Fortigreen his color was very similar to that of dark green but this crewmate had a very different behavior than the rest of the crew. Now you may be wondering, who is Fortigreen? And where did he come from? Well to start off, Fortigreen wasn't always this color. He used to be red, and a regular crewmate like the rest of us. But a tragic event took place in his life, that not only took his color, but took away his personality. Let's start at the very beginning of Fortigreen's story. As I mentioned earlier, he used to be a red crewmate, and was one of the crewmates that was stationed on the ship of Scaled. He was a respected crewmate who followed orders, and was liked by many of the crew. Until one day he stumbled upon a portal in the reactor room. He was hesitant at first to walk in, but he did it anyways. He then found himself in a deep area of space, but luckily he had his spacesuit on, so he was still able to breathe. Chrono then appeared, and Fortigreen, who was red at the time, was in complete shock. He's never seen this creature before. Fortigreen then asked a question, Who are you? Chrono responded to him with, I'm Chrono, the god of space. Fortigreen was still in disbelief, and asked Chrono, Why did he bring me here? Chrono then responded with, to make you one of us. The imposters? Fortigreen asked. And Chrono responded with, yes. Fortigreen was very hesitant. Ever since he was born, their main mission was to fight off the imposters, who were always trying to take them down. Fortigreen then told Chrono, I will never become one of you. Chrono laughed and said, very well, I don't require your assistance, and now you will pay. Fortigreen didn't understand what he was saying, until a flash of light appeared, and he was back on the ship of Scaled, in the reactor room. He then came to the realization that he was no longer red, he was now a different color, very similar to the dark green that the crewmates have. While Fortigreen was trying to process everything that was going on, Dark appeared and shot a beam of light into his head. Dark was filling him up with evil and Fortigreen could do nothing about it. The beam of light stopped and Fortigreen was no longer himself. Dark then assigned him a mission to pretend to be part of the crewmates and to hopefully one day earn their trust and take them down. Fortigreen agreed and that's how Fortigreen was created and that is why he randomly appears in your matches of Among Us. He's always watching you. I actually managed to encounter Fortigreen and I'm here to tell you everything that I witnessed. So my strange encounter with Fortigreen started off when a regular match is scaled. Usually with this mysterious color, the player will have three question marks. And as I mentioned earlier, the red color is related to Fortigreen. And what I found really strange was that the player that I was encountering had the same outfit as Sairi Sorrel. So does this mean that Sairi Sorrel and Fortigreen are connected in some way? Since Sairi Sorrel's original color is red. But the player wasn't doing anything at the moment, so I tried my best not to think about it. I saw that a few crewmates were talking in the chat, so I opened it and I saw Fortigreen sending a few question marks. Was he trying to communicate with us? Or what was the issue? Was Among Us not allowing him to send messages? And another thing that caught my eye was that the match was set to public, but no new players were joining. We were just stuck at 7. The match started and I was a crewmate. I stared at this mysterious player. At first I thought it could have just been a lobby glitch, but he was still in the game and he wasn't moving. I went to go do a few tasks in electrical, and when I was about to walk out, Forda Green walked in. I followed him to the backside of electrical, and he randomly teleported out. I went to security to look for him, and he wasn't there. And as I was about to check weapons, the body was reported. I typed in the chat, who was it? And the crewmates let me know that the body was in electrical. Another player reported the issue that I saw earlier. 
with the player walking on walls. So I responded with, who do you think it is? And White started to say that I was the last one with black. That is true, but I wasn't the imposter. I let White know that it wasn't me. Yeah, I know, I could have came up with a better excuse. Luckily, I wasn't ejected, and it gave us more time to solve this mystery. We all spawned in, and I wanted to seem as normal as possible, since people were suspecting it was me. I did my wires in storage and admin, and I wanted to complete my task, so I could have time to investigate this issue. You. As I was leaving navigation, I spotted Florida Green near the vent. I stared at him for a few seconds, but he wasn't moving so I left. When I was an admin finishing up a task, he was watching me outside. I don't know why this mysterious player is watching me, but this could mean that I'm his next victim. So I ran off and I was starting up Reactor, since Reactor was far away from Admin. When I finished up the task, the player was waiting for me outside. I stared at him once again, but then I spotted a body in security, and when I tried to walk in to report it, the door was closed. I had a huge feeling he was an imposter, so I ran off. I was fearing for my life. Why is this player after me? Well, I was in weapons, Cyan called a meeting. And in a panic, I let everyone know that it had to be Forda Green and that I ran away from him. Cyan responded to my message with three question marks. And so did Forda Green. But Forda Green was no longer green. He was red, the same color as Sairi Sorrel. I responded to Cyan, don't tell me you're with him. And I witnessed something unbelievable. Dead crewmates were responding in the chat with the same username as Forda Green. Out of my entire time playing Among Us, I never encountered a problem like this. How are dead crewmates responding and sending the same message as Fortigreen? There was only three players alive and dead crewmates were talking. And that is when Fortigreen won the game. But could this be Sari Sorrel? Before I could enter the lobby to ask the question, my game lagged out and Fortigreen was nowhere to be seen. If you would like me to continue the story between me and Fortigreen, let's see if we can get this video to 25,000 likes. I do also want to give a massive shout out to Kitty King for helping me produce this video. If you would like to help out a smaller creator, make sure to go check out his channel and subscribe to him. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button with the bell icon turned on. And make sure that you check out one of these Among Us story videos that are found on my channel.